Okay, here we have a spill of blood. Um, so we're gonna start the procedure to clean it up. We get our spill bag here. Our quick core basic kit. So we're gonna uh, apply our safety equipment, which is gloves or PPE. Make sure we have them over the cuffs of our laboratory coat. Okay, and then we're gonna take the chlorosol and we're going to pour it over our blood stain or pour or spill. And then once we pour our solution over it, we're gonna get our towels. As you can see, it's kind of diluting it. Um, and most other cleanup kits. Oh, okay. So the solution actually has to sit for 10 minutes um, while the towels are absorbing it. Some other solutions will actually change color. That's when you know that it's done. All right, we're gonna wipe up our spill, make sure everything is clean. Depending on what was spilled, whether it be blood or chemicals, you're gonna dispose of it properly. Um, our kit comes with a biohazard bag. So we're gonna put that in there. And then we're going to dispose of that in its proper container. Seal it up. Okay. Now we're going to go to our needle safety kit here. So when we're going to actually put this in a biohazard trash bag first. And then we're going to go to our needle safety. So in which case, you're going to change your gloves if you haven't already. Um, this is during regular venipuncture procedures um, that you'll be handling this needle. So um, obviously this one is already assembled. We have the hub attached to the needle. As you can see inside of this needle, we have um, the needle that actually pierces these tubes. Um, but as you can see, it has a safety um, device over it so that you don't prick yourself when you're assembling it. So we're going to pull our safety back. We're going to take the cap of our needle, inspect it. This is during regular venipuncture procedure. And then normally we would do our venipuncture and after we immediately engage our safety device and then immediately put it in the shark's container here. Um, and our tubes, if they were filled with blood and you need to discard them, you would also put it in our shark's container.